Good afternoon. Welcome back to Trade Talks. I'm your host, Jill Malandrino, Global Markets Reporter at NASDAQ. We've been coming to you live from Georgetown University's McDonough School of Business at the DC Blockchain Summit. Joining me is Mark Fisk, he's a partner over IBM Public Service, and we're going to talk about blockchain integration on the federal government side of business. Mark, thank you very much for joining us Thanks, at Jill. GU today. So tell us a bit about your role at IBM and the overall blockchain strategy. Sure. So I'm a partner in our uh, public service practice, and what I am really looking at is taking some of the great, awesome things that are going on in blockchain in all over the world with IBM mm -hmm. and bringing those to the federal government. So really focused on federal and state and local government and where they're going to need to see value in uh, their business networks that they're dealing with and how blockchain can help with that. Do you think blockchain can really transform all the issues that the federal government needs to focus on on the technology side? Yes, I'm not sure of all the issues, <laughs> but uh, we definitely can uh, look at some of the biggest challenges, right? So the challenges of trust, transparency, and accountability um, the challenges of risk and fraud detection, automation, uh, reducing time and, and cost. I think those are some things that really uh, blockchain is made for and being able to provide that across the business network will provide a lot of value for both the government and the other uh, participants in that network. Right, because there's so many different verticals across the federal gov government that blockchain needs to serve as well. Exactly, so it, it requires you to be able to understand both you know, the challenges of the government and the government agency, plus also all that interaction they have, whether it's with other governments, um, not-for-profits, commercial entities, et cetera. All right, and to wrap up, tell us what IBM is doing to leverage its blockchain services to help the government. Yeah, so we're definitely bringing some things to the table that we've done in our commercial uh, organizations, mm -hmm. uh, bringing things like design thinking, uh, user-centered design, uh, bringing our capability to quickly prototype and bring value and show the value in the business network. And uh, we're bringing that capability to government, really showing those initial places. And most importantly, we're not bringing blockchain where it doesn't really fit right. in the business network. So we're really excited about uh, the prospects. All right, well, thank you very much for joining us at GU, and thank you for joining me throughout the day. I'm Jill Malandrino, Global Market reporter at NASDAQ.